It is January 15, 2022, 7 20 p.m. Oh, this is episode 1516. It is a Saturday night, and uh, I enjoy this cartoon. Uh, I had sketched out uh, a version of this several days ago after Biden's speech, but it wasn't exactly like this one. But after I heard so many people were upset about a speech that he went too far, this morning this idea kind of came, came to me. Uh, well, to do it this way. Um, I was going to do something else that I hadn't really finalized in my head yet, uh, and I still haven't, but I might do that tomorrow. But, uh, but when I thought of this, I thought, yeah, this, let's just do this. I think people are going to like this. This is going to be okay. Uh, one guy on Facebook asked me how come I didn't put a Klansman in the cartoon. But you know what? I didn't think it needed it. I, I felt like that, that. I felt that would be going too far because I, I thought the other guys are bad enough. And I was afraid, like, and I have put Klansmen in a lot of cartoons before with these kind of guys. But I thought, these are the new Klansmen. So I, I think, and, the, and this is also literally true. I mean, it's literally true that the Klansmen support Republicans, but you don't see Republicans with them. You don't see Republicans defending them, but you do see Republicans defending what Proud Boys have done, what Oath Keepers have done, what Tiki Torch Nazis have done. Donald Trump has defended these people. He's rounded them up. He's in the QN and people. He's, he's, he's giving them shout outs. So this is just more accurate to me because this is literally it. Yeah, 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 the Klansmen are Trump supporters, but you don't see um, Trump's not giving them literal shout outs. Sure, he's retweeting Nazis and stuff like that. But you know, I, I just thought the image might distract from the other guys. I, I wanted this to be like more more to the point of the guys involved. I'm gonna spend my entire time talking about this. Um, so, yeah, that's it. I just, I don't know. Also, another thing I just thought of this is that when you put the Klansmen and you scare our Nazis, you scare a lot of publishers and editors and stuff. In fact, this might scare a lot of editors and publishers. Well, actually, it will. Um, but, yeah, that's it. I'm out watching football right now. Uh, I went uh, to Central Park today, picked up my suit, and I'm trying to debate. Well, I'm trying to decide. I'm, I'm just, my, my head is kind of screwed with if the jacket is actually too big or not. The pants are fine. But, and I put on my old, old suit for comparison, and uh, it's tight, but it looks good. <laughs> it looks better, I think. But the new one, I think it looks cool, too. I sent a photo to my friend Hillary uh, Proofer and see what she thinks, because I think she knows this kind of stuff better than I do. Uh, why am I talking about this? Because it's in my head. It's in my head. It's also January, and I have to, halfway through January, and I need to put my contest stuff together before the end of the month. <clears throat> and uh, so, and I haven't even started that, really. I, I've selected cartoons, but I haven't put anything really together. Um, folks, talked about other stuff today. There's no comments. See you tomorrow. Bye.